A man has been arrested on arson charges after setting a home on fire in Northern Township near Bemidji. Reporter Shamal Moore has the details. New Year's Day turned into tragedy for one local Bemidji family as they were forced to leave their home last night thanks to a fire. We were called at approximately 10.22 p.m. Uh, last night to a residence up in Northern Township off of Sunset Way. Uh, when deputies arrived, they found uh, fire and, and uh, smoke coming from a downstairs uh, window uh, of a split entry type home. We were able to um, relatively quickly extinguish uh, that fire. Uh, the fire, though, did extend up into the attic um, prior to our arrival. Uh, it took us a little bit longer to extinguish the attic fire, but we were able to uh, extinguish that relatively easily. Three people were in the home at the time of the blaze, including 20-year-old Damian Patrick Smith. Smith has been charged with arson, attempted murder in the first degree, and obstruction of legal process. Police say he was acting erratically during the initial investigation. Smith was first taken to the Sanford Emergency Hospital for treatment of smoke inhalation and was then booked into the Beltrami County Jail. He was reportedly unrelated to the other two people in the home. Not really quite sure what led him up to uh, uh, why he did that. We are investigating that and what his intentions were, uh, but it's our belief he intended to uh, uh, cause harm to the people in the home by setting it uh, a fire. And uh, they were just helping him out for the evening. It was a cold night and uh, uh, they were helping him out. Two people are in the home during the time of the blaze, although luckily they were able to make it out okay. Today they are in the hands of the Bemidji Red Cross. Red Cross has stepped in, found uh, them a place to stay, also helping them with clothing and some of the uh, basic essentials to begin with. But if there's any, any folks in the area that want to help out, uh, they can contact the local Red Cross office. Smith is expected to be arraigned and formally charged tomorrow. As for the home, firefighters say it can be saved. The home had, um, I'm going to say moderate damage, um, certainly isn't a total loss. Uh, there are parts of the home that did suffer some extensive damage, but there are lots of parts of the home that um, were untouched by the fire. Reporting of Imagee, Sherelle Moore, Lakeland News. The victim's names have not been released pending the investigation. Firefighters said it took about an hour to completely extinguish the blaze. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.